Right, Friday night. A uh, bit of a strange one. So here we are on VTOL VR. Clouds. Um, no, we're on, <laughs> as you very well know, we're on AMS 2. Um, so without further ado, let's go. We're on Alton Park Classic. And we're in a car that's coming out with the 1.6 update from Riser. Only it's not. Only what's happened is what the modders try to avoid, which is putting cars out that will become DLC in the future. So we're in the uh, DTM pack from Thunder Flash, which includes the V8 four-wheel drive Audi that I'm in. Well, these things happen. Be interesting to see how they compare. Oh, come on, in you go. So we're only a few weeks away from 1.6. Going from the blurb that's coming out, and there's a lot of things coming with it, along with a uh, much updated physics for the tyres and the lights, which of course will then get transposed onto all the mods as they use kind of donor vehicles, if you like, from AMS2. So as those donor vehicles get updated. So the mods. Oh, that's how I understand it works. Swamp, you see areas here. Go on. Can't beat the old DTMs, especially with the uh, if you're running them uh, as a multi-class race. So we've got the original DTMs with the Mercs and the BMs, and then the uh, from the flash pack, which has got. Let's get brake check by the BM, um, which has got oh, a load of stuff, like right the Sierras the and these Audis, left side, clear left. and Godzilla. There you go. What more can I say? Uh, we're running, obviously, AI as two cars lose it down the hill. We're using their custom AI packs and custom skin liveries. Liveries or liveries. All oh, right, Mr. Sierra. That was a late dive. Oh, don't swap sides on the brakes, mate. The DTMs always make for close racing. You can get a bit physical with them. And that Sierra's quick in a straight line. Still with me. Hold your line. Clear right. Clear right. Outbreak him and take the uh, take the racing line. Get back on the back of these. Got about 31 cars on track, so it's uh, it's a hectic one starting from the back. The two classes mixed in. Well, two classes above the same class just. Uh, so you see the BOP is exactly the same. On your left. Still there. Clear left. Okay, I Sorry, finding it hard to uh, talk. It's been a long day at work. <laughs> or should I say it's been a long three days at work on the same job. Come on, come on. Still there. Hold your line. For those of you who didn't catch the VTOL uh, video, which most of you, um, it's now got clouds on the open beta, a full weather system and time system, and lots more new cockpits for the uh, VTOL aircraft and things like that. A lot, lot more. Uh, a few of the racing guys we all jumped on, about five of us in the helicopters yesterday, and some aircraft, and went and did some missions against the AI. Some 
more planned tonight. Should be a good laugh. I'm really struggling with these. Taking no quarter, that was a bad move. Stay on the grass. Sorry, stay off the grass. It's bad for your kiddies. Trying everything. Clear right. Clear right. Let's get in with these guys. Throwing this four wheel drive Audi around, it is nose heavy, you do feel it. That's half distance. Should be around. Oh no, that's wide, that's wide. Couldn't quite hook it in. Front end drifted off. Classic Audi styling. Oh. Trying to sneak past him there, just caught him. Didn't take him out though. Hold your line. Still at the side of me. Can't see him. That's what I've got to do. Okay, now oh, we can see one of the Nissans nice up ahead there, the blue one. Just five laps of this. MST looking stunning as usual. It's a great little track, it's in part, especially this classic one, you can uh, get some decent speed up on it. Left side. Left. Lock up at the end there. So yeah, we're a few weeks away from 1.6 now. Um, it's going to be really uh, interesting to see what they've kept under the hats. I've heard a lot of rumours and a lot of things from people who are doing some testing. But obviously I'm not going to uh, spoil the surprises there. But more important, well not more importantly, the big thing for me as well is going to be looking how the, um, uh, how the new physics and modelling and stuff brings another layer to the, uh, a, well not the AI, but to the uh, mod cars, so it's going to be like having all new mod cars, and how easy is it for the modders to uh, get stuff transported over, no, nowhere to go, come on, that's uh, Calsonic up there, that blue Skyline, Godzilla is actually going over to the uh, JGTC pack. Fred's working on it at the moment, some updates on his website. You can see on his uh, front page. So obviously that will be having a, uh, a bit of an engine upgrade and on your left. all the rest of it. Well, that will add uh, an eighth car to that pack becoming a bit of a fan favourite already. A lot of people using it online. And single player. We're finally here with him. Scoot past him. Oh, that's got him deep. Ah, oh, wow. Threw the anchor out and uh, threw the baby out of the bath water. Or with the bath water, sorry. There we go, last lap. Good finish. So there you go, there's your Friday fix of AMS2 and a bit of news for you. Um, yeah, there's other stuff going on, but can't say anything yet, but hopefully soon. And I can annoy some of you again. <laughs> All right, it's been a long three days. Adios.